How we doing guys? Today we're doing a new video. We're doing a 2v2 beat battle. It's uh, me and Trav versus Jay and Tyler. We each get around 30 minutes to make a beat with the same sample. Whoever has the best beat wins. All right, Hannah is picking out the sample for them to the go off of. Timer is starting now. We got 30 minutes. Go. There's the timer. Yep. How do we feel? How do we feel? Good. Straight. You're good. That's a good beat. <laughs> yeah, it's up. A lot of guitar playing, I saw. Yeah, I'm so loud. Next team ready to play. Let's go. It felt like a movie, Rakai. Like Got the timer starting in five, four, three, two. You got 30 minutes. Yeah, we made it. And that's fine. I was about that. Feel pretty good, man. The, peop the people would decide, but I think we gave them a little bit of two worlds with just the production background, and then we actually gave them a little ref, try to bring the song to life. So I'm about to go over the, like, go over all the aspects of me and Travis' beat for the beat challenge. So we have, and we can start with the intro, where the intro is just like a filtered version of the beat. It goes right into the chorus, so Trav played a few guitar parts here. So that with the rest of the chorus parts is like this. Then after that we go into the verse part where I took the loop again and I put halftime on it. Let's play again halftime. And Trav played two other parts, so here's those two. And right before the chorus came back again, we had this little pre chorusy part. Trav put another guitar part over the intro, we have right before it goes back into the chorus. back into the chorus again and then there's just the outro where it fades and that is the beat that me and Trav made with the sample back with another video but fuck um shit another beat right now so first thing we did is we took the, the sample we transposed it down four and then I threw it in the quick sampler and then sliced it up and replayed it out at a faster BPM, so we got. Versus when it started, which was. After that, I layered that with uh, the same exact pattern but with half time on it. And what this is gonna do is it's going to fill out the space more. And then for a little textural stuff, just some loop raider and then some um, effect tricks. Very, very minimal, just to add some texture. And then I laid the high hats down. And then Jay laid the 808 and the, the, the rest of this percussion down here. And then Jay laid the 808 down up here. And then this right here is a little uh, kalimba I played. A little bit of loop. 
operator, just add a little bit of a, some movement to it. So all together so far we got. What's really interesting is that we have the intro comes in immediately. I'm showing you immediately what you're gonna what you're gonna expect. But then I take it all away. And then down here we got a little bit of um, some shaper box action going on where we bounced a section of the beat down and then we threw an effect on it. So we got And then we threw the, the drums on it. And then we didn't bring back the main melody yet. But what I did give you is something new that Jay laid down, which is he bounced the drums down into one thing through Shaper Box on, which sounds like this. So that is layered all the way underneath all this. So what that's doing is that I'm giving you what everything's gonna happen, cut everything out, something new, familiar something new, mm -hmm. familiar something new, full familiarity, which is comes into repetition and stuff like that. And then after that, it was just a quick little repeat, and then boom, that's that's the whole thing bang, boom. All right guys, so you saw both teams make their beats, break down their beats. So now it's only up to you to let us know who you think really won. Either Trav and me, or Jay and Tyler. Who knows, they both sound good to me, so leave it down in the comments. Follow Hit Music Social on all platforms. Follow BitBoy and Hit Music Official on everywhere. And we'll see you next week.